guys! So really quickly I'm going to do an intro for this video. I just finished filming it so I did my everyday makeup routine and it has been quite a while since I've done one of these. I think that the last one I did was actually last August. So it's been quite a while and I've been getting asked a lot lately if I could do one of these again. So I decided that I would do it because obviously some stuff has changed since the last one I did. But before I get into it I just want to do a little disclaimer and say that this is my full face makeup routine. So this is what I do on days that I have to work or something like that or if I'm going out somewhere which is quite often there's not a lot of days where I'm just lounging around my house but I mean there definitely are days where I feel like wearing a little bit less than this or there's days where I feel like wearing a little more than this like a little bit more in my eyes or my lips or something so um, just keep that in mind that this is not what I do like every single day it's just like most days so um, yeah if you guys are interested in watching my everyday makeup routine then just stay tuned because I'm gonna jump right into it Okay, so the first thing that I do is I take Benefit's Pore Professional Primer and apply this to my nose. Then I take Smashbox Photo Finish Light Primer and apply this to the rest of my face. Then I take the new CoverGirl Outlast 3-in-1 foundation and just kind of dot this all over my face randomly. And then I take the Quo Blending Sponge and I make sure that it's damp before I use it. This is pretty much a knockoff of the Beauty Blender and it's way cheaper so I love this one. And like I said I use it damp and I pretty much just blend it in using a patting motion. I never rub with it, I always make sure to like press the foundation into my skin. Then I use my Garnier Tinted Eye Roller under my eyes. I like to use this especially in the morning because it's cool and it gives me a little bit of coverage. Then I just take that same Quo blending sponge and blend that in. Then I go over that concealer with my L'Oreal True Match Concealer. I like to use this over top just for a little bit of extra coverage because I personally like that full coverage concealer look. Then I just set all my liquid products with the Rimmel Stay Matte Powder. I wear the color Translucent and I love this powder because it's one of the only powders that keeps me matte all day, even in my T-zone. So I pretty much just blot this on all over that foundation and concealer. Then I take my Pure Minerals Bronzer in the color Medium Dark, and this is actually a face powder, not a bronzer, but it's one of the only colors that I like with my skin tone. And then after that I take the Benefit Throb Box Powder, and I use this as a blush and highlight. And this kind of changes for me every day, but this is the one that I've been loving recently. Then I take this matte brown eyeshadow in this MAC Duo that I have with my Sigma E65 angled brush and I just start to fill in my brows. I've been doing them a lot thinner lately but I kind of like to change up the way that I do them and I personally like the look of a stronger brow that's just kind of the way that I roll with mine and I do understand that that's not for everybody so I just recommend staying within your comfort zone. Now we're going to move on to the eyes, so I'm going to start with my Essence Eye Primer and I'm just going to apply this to my lids and then simply blend it in with my fingers. Then I mix these two champagne shades together from my mini Smashbox Soft Lights palette and just apply this all over my lid. Next I take Naked 2 from the Urban Decay Naked Basics palette and I just apply this into my crease using a big fluffy blending brush. And then I just simply line my upper lash line with the Urban Decay 24 hour eyeliner in the color Perversion. Then I generously apply a couple coats of the CoverGirl Lash Blast 24 hour mascara to my lashes.
Now I'm going to take my gouache white eyeliner and apply this into the waterline just to give my eyes a little bit of an extra pop. Then I'm going to take that purple essence eyeliner that I just showed and apply that below the white right into my lash line. And that is actually all that I do for my eyes. So it's pretty quick and easy and I love that pop of purple for the spring and summer. Then on my lips, I'm going to use the least Swatier lipstick in the color Jennifer. I love this lipstick because not only is the color payoff amazing, but it's also super moisturizing. And lastly, I'm just going to lock in all that makeup with the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. I literally cannot live without this stuff anymore because it's so amazing. And that is actually it for my everyday makeup routine, so I hope that you guys enjoyed it and thank you so much for watching it today. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and of course follow me on Twitter and Instagram. I'll have all of that linked down below for you guys. I love you guys all so much and I hope you're all having an amazing day wherever you are and I will talk to you guys all in my next video.